All right, y'all, we are back with another video. And here we go again with Corrupt Jack Smith. Now, one thing I can say about Judge Eileen Cannon is that she ain't just letting Jack Smith just come in and just try to tell her what to do. Because remember, this man is trying to get this woman to do a speedy trial. Because like I said, they already trying to take out Donald Trump. And uh, Judge Eileen Cannon is not going for that. Now, this one right here is coming from Doug. He said that Jack Smith reversed by Judge Eileen Cannon. No more seekers. Then he went on to say that Jack Smith just got blasted by Judge Cannon for trying to cover up another investigation the DOJ is trying to hide from Donald Trump. Now, we definitely got to go ahead and jump straight off into this. Like I said, we already know how corrupt these people are. We already know that. So like I said, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Shout out to everybody showing so much support. Everybody been leaving positive comments in the comment section. I also want to thank everybody who clicked on the video for the very first time. I appreciate all of you. And shout out to the ones that always watches the entire video. I appreciate all of you that do that because YouTube will share it so more people can see my reaction. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into this. And let's see what Doug got for us today, y'all. Let's go. I'm trying to go as fast as I can because I'm fighting off a cold and pretty soon I'm going to lose my voice. I'm going to lose everything. So I got to go as fast as I can, guys. This is about Judge Aileen Cannon reversing Jack Smith. Remember, Jack Smith wanted to keep all the documents private and Aileen mm -hmm. Cannon said, no, you can't. So nope. we're going to get into that because this is a great victory for Trump's side because it forces Jack Smith to be public about what he's doing. Anything he wants to hide this is how you stop him and expose the Democrat Party for what they're doing in our justice system, being corrupt. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Doug in Exile. I'm Doug. You guys subscribing really has helped this channel out. We're rocketing our way past 340,000 subs. So I'd love to have you guys on the team. Hop on in. Here's Newsweek. Jack Smith fails to persuade Aileen Cannon to keep Trump info secret. Ooh. He wanted to keep what he's doing a secret. Here's the great Julie Kelly on Twitter. Hold the champagne, Jack Smith. Judge Cannon, as expected, just threw cold water on the Department of Justice's win in D.C. appellate court today. She grants in part Trump's request to unseal some discovery that Jack Smith wants to keep under wraps. So that's good. the good news. Here's the, here's the legal document following an, an independent review of the motion and full re record. The court determines with limited exceptions as detailed below that the special counsel has not set forth a sufficient factual or legal basis warranting deviation from the strong presumption in favor mm. of public access to the records at issue. So that means we get to have access to his records. Now, although substantiated witness uh, safety and intimidation concerns can form a valid basis for overriding the strong presumption in favor of public access, the special counsel's sparse and undifferentiated response fails to provide the court with the necessary factual basis to justify the ceiling. So that she went back to Jack Smith and said, give me a reason. And it says it was an undifferentiated response. It wasn't robust enough. Right. So no, we're not going to seal them. This relates to Trump's request to unredact some information the defense obtained through discovery productions and FOIA uh, responses. FOIA is Freedom of Information Act. Jack Smith basically opposed unsealing anything. He wants it all covered up. Here's the legal document <laughs> third. With respect to the special counsel's desire to shield, quote, the FBI code name of a separate investigation, unquote, which we're going to find out that the FBI had opened up another investigation on Trump that they have not disclosed to the public yet. We're going to find out. Neither the special counsel's publicly filed response nor the accompanying sealed filing identifies the information it seeks to redact. So it was just giving a blanket redaction saying, Every, we want to mark everything up at the black marker so you can't see it. Here's right. Julie Kelly. You can almost hear her yelling at Jack Smith for filing under seal unclassified information like you dummy. She can see it behind closed doors. She goes, you don't redact this. You weirdos. God bless Judge Cannon on a day uh, yes. when there's little reason to have any faith in the judiciary. Aileen Cannon, we're putting our faith 
back in the judiciary because she's acting normal. The Mm -hmm. motion for leave shall be filed publicly, except in clear and supported cases of risk to personal safety or national security. Those are the rules. That's the only reason that you should do it. And she knows now because she's seen it that none of that's in there. Done and ordered in chambers of Fort Pierce, Florida, the 6th day of February, 2024. A lean cannon signed U.S. State District Judge. Good job, Cannon. Let's let Jack Smith weep in his pink panties. That's what he's going to do. He's such a crybaby. And this is good because it means we're going to get to see another investigation they tried to pull on Trump and, uh, and frame him for something he didn't do. This has been done. Shout out to Doug. Man, Jack Smith is so corrupt. Once again, shout out to Judge Aileen Cannon. He tried like he basically trying to force the judge to keep stuff a secret. And now even more stuff finna come out that we finna get ready and find out. This this right here is just mind blowing. This man is so freaking corrupt. See, people like this, these are the people that need to be in jail. These type of pe- uh, people, the Jack Smiths. The Avon Braggs, Letitia James, Fannie Willis. These are the people that need to go down. Look what this man was trying to force the judge to do. He was already trying to force her to hurry things up. Y'all remember that? He was trying to force her to hurry things up because, like I said, they're trying to take Trump out. They're trying to take him out. And this man is just trying to make it, make it his business to take down Donald Trump and try to force the judge. Because, see, the thing is, Judge Eileen Cannon has been one of the fair judges to Donald Trump. Everybody else been like Democrat judges that don't like Donald Trump. So, basically, this whole time, Trump ain't been getting a fair file. You know what I'm saying? He ain't been getting a fair trial. Because every time he go to the courtroom, either he can't speak or the judge need to know what he's going to say. Just like what we just heard with the uh, E. Jean Carroll situation. They couldn't even speak. They couldn't even really just testify. Because basically the judge already had their mind made up. So Judge Eileen Cannon, she's been one of the fairest judges. So I say salute to her for that. We need to get Jack Smith the hell up out of here. We, We need to go. We are so sick of Jack Smith and him trying to pour this dumb stunt. And be and then he tries to get mad at the judge. Now you're trying to force this woman to keep something secret. You're trying to force the judge to keep something secret that you don't want nobody to know. Now even more stuff is about to come out. Even more stuff. So what you gonna do now, Jack? But once again, like I said, shout out to uh Judge Eileen Cannon for this. Like I said, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. We're going to keep on exposing these fake people like this, man. We're going to expose the real corrupt people because Donald Trump is not corrupt. The people that are going after him is corrupt because look what they're trying to do. Because Jack Smith, he see what the other judges are doing to Donald Trump. So now he's trying to force Eileen Cannon to do it, but she ain't going for it. She calling it right down the middle, and she ain't finna let you come here and make her speed things up, make her try to keep stuff a secret. She pretty much kicked him out the courtroom. She basically saying, no, I'm not going to do that. So once again, shout out to Judge Eileen Cannon. Like I said, y'all hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.